are you feeling? Any second thoughts? I'm fine. Are you sure? Okay, really. <laughs> You're gonna make me cry. The past five years that I have spent with you have taught me so much. But if I learned nothing else from our relationship, it was how to truly love someone more than myself. You were always that way, and it took me years, but I finally picked up on it. Almost too late. I can easily say that you've seen me at my worst. But no matter what I did or how badly I treated you, you responded with nothing but love. And it is your unwavering selflessness that continues to inspire me. You know how to make me laugh even when I don't want to. True laughter that resonates throughout me and for a few brief moments makes me feel as though I couldn't possibly ever be happy. You took the time to get to know me better than anyone and in the process you've changed me for the better. You taught me to swallow my pride, to practice forgiveness, and that the fairest way to judge someone is by how quickly a smile fades from their face. You made it so easy to love you that it took me a very long time before I realized that I did. I never imagined I would ever get married. The thought of living with the same person for the rest of my life never appealed to me. But knowing you and falling in love with you has erased all of those reservations that I once had. We've bickered and argued more times than I can count, usually prompted by me. But none of those fights will ever be as memorable or meaningful as some of the best moments of my life that I've gotten to share with you. It's difficult to put into words, but there is a feeling that I get when I'm around you. And understanding that you are the only person who could ever make me this happy. Happier than I ever deserved to be. I hope you don't think it's strange that I'm standing here in my wedding dress, but I didn't know what else to wear. This is supposed to be the happiest day in my life. And these candles and flower arrangements were picked and purchased with much more cheerful intentions. Instead, I have to say goodbye to the person I love the most. So I'll try my best to make it a good one. So goodbye to the house we'll never live in together. Goodbye to the children we'll never have. Goodbye to the anniversaries we'll never celebrate. Goodbye, Adam. I love you.